Hi, I'm honored uh, that the first uh, Wharton Global Alumni Forum held in Spain, it's uh, been in one of our hotels. For me, it's, uh, it's uh, at, at the end to see the result of this uh, hard 13 months of a tremendous job of uh, bringing sponsors at the at the worst time ever here in Spain with the much uh, with uh, such a financial crisis uh, to be able to have uh, 500 uh, registrants or 510 that it's uh, the second uh, record here in the in the MIR region it's a uh, very success in this forum there was a completely change and we were using new systems we we launched uh, the LinkedIn group uh, uh, through uh, Madrid, uh, Gaff, uh, Wharton Gaff Madrid, uh, and it has been extremely successful, and uh, and it has helped uh, uh, for networking previous, during, and after the forum itself. Uh, another objective was uh, PR to raise the recognition. Uh, it's uh, not the same the the brand, uh, what it represents, and the brand recognition here in Southern Europe, or it, I would say in the total EMEA region. Uh, as it is in the States. So we, we needed uh, this kind of forums in order to, to increase uh, the brand recognition. My first uh, responsibility is uh, having accepted to chair uh, the EMEA board and uh, translating really an advisory board to uh, an executive board. We are transforming that board, we are helping Wharton, but uh, one of the beauties is that uh, we've got a dean that is leading this uh, university beautifully and that is listening to the different stakeholders. For sure, he's listening to the board members and it's adapting the university to, the, to different uh, um, changes that are required in, in the 21st century. For Wharton to be the best business school in the world, it has to be the best business school for the world. And it's clear that uh, ethics and values are essential. It's not just that um, we need to, to have uh, ethics uh, as one of our core courses, but that in each one of the cases, in, in the different curricula that, uh, that uh, our alum, alum, uh, current alumnus go through, there's always opportunities to have ethical decisions in each one of the, of the cases. This is what we want, and that really we have uh, the future leaders of tomorrow, the people that can change uh, the, the life in, in the 21st century.